I was watching a show on the History Channel today. They were talking about the Bible code, how they have a, uh, a code that they've developed that allows them to go through the ancient Hebrew texts and decipher messages that uh, the writers had left in a coded form. Uh, the main debate that they're talking about right now, I just paused the show, is uh, prophecy. The idea that the person who wrote the code or who put these messages in the code could prophesize the future. But the point that was brought to my attention, or uh, something that I thought about while listening to this, was one of the gentlemen that was talking, one of the scholars that was talking, was talking about you know how modern day uh, people don't have the capacity to be prophets that are, are, are that we don't have the uh, faith to be of a zealot nature to be able to be so in tune with the religion that uh, we can have an insight to the higher powers and that got me thinking uh, specifically about the origin of religions uh, specific, more specifically about um, the relationship that people developed with those religions in the beginning. What was it about the religions themselves that gave people that much faith? If you think about it, if you look at, um, if using Christianity as an example, look at the origin of Christianity, where it came from. You know, when Jesus became the prophet of God and talked and brought Christianity into the world, it was new. It was this one man who was, who was performing these miracles, supposedly, and, uh, people followed him. How is it that strength of faith can be created on such a level through something that new? Wouldn't it require, you know, a test over time of a person's faith in whatever religion it happens to be to have them reach that level of belief? Can something that new incite something that powerful? That's what I was thinking about, and uh, I wanted to see what you guys out there thought, guys and gals. Just in, in general, about the idea of, you know, if somebody were to create a religion today, if a prophet or a messiah or what have you were to come forward today and create uh, Bob's religion, or what, what, Bobism, whatever the hell you want to call it, would faith in that religion be so strong that what would re be required by this particular concept of, of, of prophecy or being a prophet of that religion could could it be created you know what would it take what what about a religion would it take to cause that in another in a person I would think that it would take time and you know that studying and um, understanding or coming to an understanding of the religion before you can have that deeper connection to it or, you know, is this a statement about the mindset of the people centuries ago when these religions originated? I mean, does that say something about the people? Does that say something about, you know, the person who created the idea? Their, their arguments and their statements were so moving and powerful that it, it created that feeling in another person? I, I don't know. But I wanted to see what you guys and gals had their thoughts, so let me know.